Hey Gemini, welcome to your general reading for the second half of May. This is a general and will not resonate with everybody, unfortunately. Let me stick a Vaughn back in. Sorry, yes, yeah, so it will not resonate with everybody, but I do personal readings. My email will be in the description box as always. Thank you guys for all the likes, shares and subscriptions. It really means a lot to me, you guys. And all the positive, lovely comments and you guys sharing with each other and building each other up. It really means a lot to me. So, yeah. Let's see what we have going on for Gemini. What's the message from your angels? This is the message from your angels deck. show you the card first and then I'll read it to you your desired outcome will occur in the very near future have patience and faith and don't try to force it to happen guess that's kind of like let go of your control issues now I'll be using the royal dark tarot deck because everybody keeps asking me so I try to name the decks as I'm going Let's see, Gemini. Oh, the Knight of Wands. The Knight of Wands. Your desired outcome is very near. Here he is, he's on his way. Her, him. Somebody's on their way. Have patience because they are rushing to get to you here. They really are with this Knight of Wands. Like, you can see the speed in this car, in this card. It's even like this girl had to jump out the way because they're rushing in so fast. So, this is, um, you know, whatever you've been waiting on job, love, money, it's nearly here. Okay, thank you for the correction, the lovers. This lover is um, very he, very near. It's a divine love connection. And I feel like you can feel them getting closer here. Because of how he's sort of like on her back. I feel like you can feel it. It might even cause you restless nights. Because you can pick up the energy of somebody coming in. It's like, I don't know how I know. I just know that, you know, they're nearby. Ace of Pentacles. Wonderful. So what are they nearby with? An offer. An offer. They're coming in to offer you something here. Um, in regards to career, money. Um, this could be a windfall of money with the Ace of Pentacles. With um, the Lovers and the Ace of Pentacles, I see you signing a new contract. So you could be starting a new job here. So, wonderful. <laughs> Two fell out. The King of Pentacles. Good job. Good business to work for. Good money coming in. And the Two of Wands. So I feel like it could be an earth sign for some of you wanting to make an offer to you. Um, about a love connection and then you are the one with the decision to be to make with the two of wands so even if you're cross watching the decision will be for you okay so um you know the proposition the offer whatever is going to be for you you're going to be the one with the two of wands here with the decision to make I feel like um, it's like, can we fix this? But it's sort of like, love will find its way here. Knight of Pentacles. So they've been slow. They've been slow in the past here. 
but this is slow, steady, cautious energy. So maybe you should take your time with any decisions here. Take your time with any decisions, even if it's regarding work. Take your time. There's no rush. If somebody asks you out um, and they want to be with you, they'll still want to be with you um, a few weeks later. If they don't want to be with you a few weeks later, guess what? They wasn't the right one. So yeah, take as much time as you feel comfortable with. Be slow and cautious with your decision making. Five of Pentacles. Okay, so let's relate this to money first. So, you know, if you are, if money's tight um, or you're not happy in your career, um, I feel like a new job offer is coming but it's not coming just yet. It's going to be um, some time. Um, so I would tell you spend and save wisely while, while you're waiting to switch careers here. If you don't have a job, um, you know, again, same applies. Spend and save wisely. Don't be rushing around and spending money on things you don't need. You know, make a decision here, you know, right, I'm going to just make, spend a certain amount e each month and then I can look for my dream job. You know, things like that. Um, in regards to love, as I mentioned, if somebody um, wants, wants to come in, make you an offer and you have to decide, do I take this or not? Be very slow. You don't want to be quick off the mark and then left out in the cold. Be slow, be cautious. Let them prove themselves. Because love will find its way here. Love is finding its way to you. And you want it to be rich and nurturing and fulfilling. You know, a divine love connection. Because you may feel like nobody's come along for me in so long. And then two come up at once. And then you feel like you have to rush and make a decision. The devil so an indication of a capricorn as we have the king of pentacles here as well um but it could also be um people involved in toxic behaviors again i'll go to money first um you could be gambling or things like that you know spending on things you don't need to spend on right now it could be that sort of toxic behavior in regards to relationships um, you could be rushing into them and then them not coming to anything. You know, you need to slow down and be more cautious. That's for some. For others here, I feel like um, it's an earth sign coming in to offer you something, offer you um, a relationship. Uh, or, or it could just be like um, a businessman coming in and wants a relationship with you. Start spending money on you. And you would be cautioned to slow things down and, you know, let them prove love as well. Because I see a lot of things in this reading, but no cups yet. You know, this could be a divine connection. Or this could be somebody who turned their back on a divine connection um, and went, you know, to another person and they are... They left you out in the cold or you left them out in the cold and um, now they're slowly making their way back to you here because they've realised everything that glitters isn't gold. So having to overcome temptation with the devil card. Five of swords. So yeah, kind of felt like all these offers could have been a lose-lose situation. Um, they may have been tempting in the beginning, but um, they may have not, nothing may have come of them. And that's why you're asked to slow things down. You know, be wise with your energy with the five of pentacles. Don't give your energy, you know, save it. Save it wisely. Put it into yourself. That love that you put into others, put into yourself. Because your desired outcome is here. It's nearly here. 
But if you gave your energy to everybody else, um, then what would you have left to give? You know? So let's see. Seven of Swords. So yeah, the scenario I said about somebody could have chosen somebody else. Somebody could have been lying to you, deceiving you, caused arguments because they was tempted away. Um, temptation got in the way or this devil energy got in the way. Um, so, you know, this person could have been lying to, or deceiving you in the past or they could be doing that in the present that um, wherever it resonates with you as it's a general reading. So, and that, I feel like you could find out about these toxic behaviours, this lies and deceptions come out, maybe about a third party and, um, you know, it causes these arguments and this tough energy with this, these five, fives of swords, five of pentacles, that's quite tough energy. You know, feeling the lack and that, you know, it's not going to turn out right, whatever you do here. But it's saying your desired outcome is here. Have patience. Don't give up hope. Have faith. You know, just be cautious and be trusting of the divine. Don't try and force things. If you're trying to rush it to happen, it won't happen. You need to let go of, um, you know, control issues or this devil energy of um, codependency and things like that. Love finds a way. It really does. Good luck, guys.